Hey guys, in the registration form, there is in this email field and we have to validate and check the sanity of the field for every input field. Then we can provide the good security for our application. So what are we going to do here? We're going to check the if the entered email is valid. So I'm going to use the standard li library for regular expressions and let's write uh, regex together. So it will have this starting character and ending character. We're going to put everything here. So basically it will have the first part, which is our account. Then we have to put add sign and we're going to have second part of our email. Then we're going to put the dot. This is, if you don't, so this is a special character in regex. So if we put just a without the backslash, then it means you can put any character. So we have to escape it with the backslash. Then we're going to put the last part, which is at least going to be two characters, but can be longer. So we indicate this like that. So let's go to the first part. So we're going to have alphanumeric characters. It's going to be capital or lowercase. And we're going to put two numbers. And then we're going to have underscore, we can put dot here, dot is possible, we can use literals here. And we can put percent and we can put plus sign and minus sign. Be careful with the minus, it has to come to end or the starting point, otherwise it means the range. So we got to be careful with that. And uh, the second part, we're going to put again alphanumeric characters, A, Z. And we're going to put, uh, since it's a domain, we can put dash and we can also put, we can also put dot here as well. And for the extension, which can just put the alphanumeric ones. And that's basically it. So I also edit some tests, but let's come here and complete the rest of the code. So we're going to check if the regex is matching the string. So we got to check the email part. If it's not matching, then we got to throw, we got to return the project errors, which is invalid email. Otherwise we're going to return nil. So let's come here and test, test our passing. 